Hello everyone, welcome to Route to Mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting Olympiad question. So, the given question is if m and n are positive integers that satisfy the equation root m plus 2005 divided by root n equals to 2006, then find the value of m and n. Okay. So, here we have given the equation with two unknown values m and n, and here we have given m and n are positive integers. And we are asked to find the values of m and n. Okay. So, without any delay, let's start the solution. So, we have given root m plus 2005 divided by root n equals to 2006. Let's take it as equation 1. Okay. So, here we have given m and n are positive integers. Right. In order to satisfy this equation 1, the value of n must be such that it completely divides 2005. Okay. Let consider that number be k root n equals to 2005. Here k root n is a number that completely divides 2005. So, here k is any factor of 2005 okay so from here we can write root n equals to 2005 divided by k now squaring both the side we have n equals to 2005 divided by k whole square let's take it as equation 2 similarly here also we can write k equals to 2005 divided by root n now let's just substitute the value of k. So by substituting the value of k in equation 1, we have root m plus k equals to 2006. So this implies this, root m equals to 2006 minus k. Now squaring both the side, we have m equals to 2006 minus k whole square. Let's take it as equation 3. So, we have taken k as a factor of 2005. So, what are the factors of 2005? So, the factors of 2005 are 1, 5 and 401. So, these three are nothing but are the values of k. Let's just find the values of m and n for each value of k. So, in the case 1, let's consider k equals to 1. So, from equation 2, we have n equals to 2005 divided by k whole square. And from equation 3, we have m equals to 2006 minus k whole square. Let's just put the value of k here. So, here we are getting n equals to 2005 square and m equals to 2005 square as well. So, here we are getting m and n values equals to 2005 square and 2005 square. Okay. Now, in the case 2, we will consider the value of k as 5. So, from equation 2, we have n equals to 2005 divided by 5 whole square, which is equals to n equal to 401 square. Similarly, from equation 3, we have m equals to 2006 minus k whole square, which is equals to 2006 minus 5 whole square, which is equals to 2001 square. So, here we are getting m and n equals to 2001 square and 401 square. Now, in the case 3, we will consider the value of k equals to 401. Okay. So, the value of n equals to 2005 divided by 401 square and m equals to we have 2006 minus k whole square 
विच इज इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड सिक्स माइनस फोर हंड्रेड वन स्क्वेर विच इज इक्वल टू वन फाइव वन फाइव स्क्वेर एंड ह्योर वी आर गेटिंग एन इक्वल्स टू फाइव स्क्वेर विच इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी फाइव सो ह्योर वी हैव एम एंड एन इक्वल्स टू वन फाइव वन फाइव स्क्वेर एंड ट्वेंटी फाइव दस द वैल्यूज ऑफ एन इक्वल्स टू टू थाउजेंड फाइव स्क्वेर एंड टू थाउजेंड फाइव स्क्वेर अनदर वन इज टू हंड्रेड वन स्क्वेर एंड फोर हंड्रेड वन स्क्वेर एंड वन फाइव वन फाइव स्क्वेर कॉमा ट्वेंटी फाइव इज आवर आंसर I hope you have understood the solution thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for more such interesting videos thank you